I saw this driver online and I had to buy it immediately. Why? Because it is 750cc head size. I have never seen anything so ridiculous in my life and I can't wait to hit it. Hi guys, it's Rick Shields down here at Quest Golf Academy. If you are new to my YouTube channel, welcome. Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any videos. Also hit the like button if you think this is the most ridiculous club you've ever seen. And also share this video around. Now, many of you know the maximum size of a driver head is 460cc. That's what the governing rules of golf says it has to be. It can't be any larger. Well, this monster has been created at 750 cc. So it's one and a half times larger. So it is not deemed suitable for tournament golf. It is illegal. You can't use it. But that doesn't matter in this video because I'm going to smash it on GC Quad to see how it performs. Oh my goodness. Setting it up behind the ball, it is gigantic. N nothing I've ever seen before. The face is really, really deep. I mean, it's just obscene. I've got an iPhone 10 here and the, and the phone comfortably sits on top of the driver and pretty much sits in level with the face as well compared to a normal 460cc driver. And I normally hit a 460cc driver about 280 yards carry, getting around about 300 total distance. So it'll be interesting to see how far I hit the monster. In kind of perspective, it is tiny the 460. Right, and my predictions, I, it's going to be tough to call, but I, I can't imagine I'm going to swing this as fast. I normally swing the club about 110 miles per hour. I can't imagine I'm going to swing it fast just because of the sheer size, but will it go further? With the size of the head is the more trampoline effect. Bearing in mind this, this driver is illegal, so anything goes. Oh my, let's give it a hit. Right, <laughs> this is literally the first time I have hit this driver. I've had to tee it up higher. Oh, this is going to be so loud. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that is ridiculously loud. It's not a bad hit. 275 carry for 300 or just under 300 yard total distance. But the noise of that driver was obscene. It really was. It was so loud. Uh, some good numbers, 160 ball speed, 110 miles per hour club head speed. So I've not lost anything really there. Not bad for the first shot with the absolute monster driver. It's a bit fadey up the right hand side. I'm going to see how far I can hit this. That's 271, but a big slice off line. Just under 300 yards. I can get this over 300 yards, definitely. Okay, shot number three. Come on. That is munched. That is absolutely smashed. 283 yards of carry distance for three, nine, 309 yards. Not the fastest swing speed there, only 107, but the ball speed I got off that face was outrageous. Can I hit it any further than that? That's the question. There's one thing for sure. You're not going to miss this driver just because of the sheer size, but you've got to be confident because as daft as it sounds, even though the head's huge, it's knowing where that head is to make you hit the best golf shot. Get up there. It's not much further than what I'd normally hit a driver. It's probably a little bit when I really jump on it, but not astoundingly different. It's a 750cc driver head. That was a blast hitting this thing. One and a half times bigger than a normal driver head completely illegal cannot be used in play in tournaments and why did it make me hit the ball further not really it made me hit the ball about exactly the same distance as i normally hit a driver did i enjoy hitting it absolutely was it loud ridiculous it was top level probably the loudest driver i've ever heard i think it's one of those things where driver size has a limit and it should stay there it doesn't need to massively go any bigger i think i've probably spent 200 pound on a driver that uh, wouldn't be going in my bag. <laughs> Not one that's going to make me hit the ball any further, but an interesting experiment and one that I enjoyed a lot. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, smash that like button. If this is the most ridiculous club you've ever seen, I'd love to hear your comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and we'll see you next time with some more crazy ideas and some crazy golf clubs. See you next time.